Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to solve this interesting logic problem. We have, we need to complete this numeric series. So we have 2, 3, 5, 7, 11 and we need to find the last number. Right here on the bottom we have a lot of options, so A, B, C and D. So right now let's check your logic, so pause the video and try to solve it by yourself and after 20 seconds we will check, we will check our answer. I swear it will be more interesting for you to, to solve it by yourself and of course after 20 seconds we will solve this interesting question. So let's put one option and of course let's let's try to solve it. So firstly take a look, we have a lot of numbers, so 2, 3, 5, 7 and 11. So let's try to find the pattern between all these numbers, for example using addition. If we add to this to 1, we'll have 3. Right here we need to add 2, right here 2 and right here 4. So as for me there is no pattern between 1, 2, 2 and 4. And moreover about subtraction situation will be will be the same. What about multiplication and addition? If we for example multiply it, as you can see we don't have any like natural number to multiply. And how can we how can we do with this? Take a look. This is a really good, a really interesting numeric series because 2, 3, 5, 7 and 11 <coughs> also known as prime numbers. So what is the prime number? This is a whole number greater than 1 whose only factors are 1 and itself. So take a look, right here we have 2. So the factors of 2 is only 1, so we can divide this 2 by 1 and 2 by 2 only. This 3 can be divided by only by 1 and by itself, 3 by 3. This 5 as well, 5 over 1 and 5 over 5. This 7 as well, 7 over 1 and 7 over, over 7. And the same situation will be with, with this 11. So I hope you see that right here we have a like numeric series is the, our prime numbers. So what is the prime numbers? I want to write with this way. So prime numbers, prime numbers. So 2, 3, 5, 7, 11. The next one will be will be our number because we need to find it. This is our serial. But what about the next one? After 11 we will have we will have 12. 12 is not good because 12 can be divided by 1, by 2, by 3, by 4. So this is not a prime number. What is the next number? The next number is 13. And what about 13? It's really good because can be this 13 can be divided by 1 and 13 only. So our next number is is 13 because this is like an, a numeric series with the prime numbers. So I hope you understand this explanation. Maybe you have another pattern between all of these numbers. It will be really instant to read it. So if you solve it by in another way, so of course write your suggestion in a comment. And of course if you still have any question about prime numbers and about this solution, write your question in a comment. I try to answer for everyone. And thank you so much for watching. See you in the next videos.